Also breaking at this moment, Leonardo da Vinci's world-famous painting, The Mona Lisa, has been attacked. Two protesters threw soup at the priceless artwork, which is protected by thick, bulletproof glass in the Louvre Museum in Paris. The attackers then called for reforms to the agricultural system. And we can bring in our correspondent Lisa Louis in Paris. Lisa, is the world's most famous painting damaged? Well, it's not actually. As you said, it's behind bulletproof glass. And I just talked to a spokeswoman from the Louvre who confirmed that the uh, the painting has not been damaged. She, she said everything is okay. The room has been reopened and everything is back to normal. Who did it? What do we know? Well, we know that it's, uh, it was done by a group that is called Riposte Alimentaire, which means dietary response. They are asking, as you said, for a, a relaunch of uh, the dietary system here in France. A spokesman has given an interview to the French press saying uh, that they were in favor of some kind of new system based on healthy on healthy diet, a democratic system with uh, cards across different cards across across the country built up by uh, democratic democratic assemblies and uh, that um, uh, agricultural uh, companies and farmers would be paid if they provided uh, you know healthy and sustainable food so they have uh, some kind of uh, dietary revolution in mind and they said this would be the first action of several Lisa this is not the first time the Mona Lisa has come under attack what about security at the museum how come the Louvre can't seem to avoid these kinds of incidents well, there is security in place at that very famous museum. There are, you know, detectors, uh, your bag is searched when you want to enter, before you enter the museum. And also, uh, they have certain rules in place. Obviously, you're not allowed to bring uh, weapons into the museum. You also, uh, they're also saying that you can't bring a, an excessive amount of food and drinks into the museum as they're putting it. But you, you can tell that these limits are apparently uh, not very clear. Maybe they will change these limits, but the spokeswoman I talked to earlier today, she said that they were not thinking about this at this uh, very uh, moment. And as I said, this painting has not been damaged, so, so uh, maybe they think we can protect uh, the paintings that we have as is. That was DW correspondent Lisa Louis in Paris. Thank you so much.